Hi, I'm John from The M Kitchen. The question I get asked most of all is how to make Yorkshire puddings. I'm going to show you how I make Yorkshire puddings. First thing you need is a dish that you're going to measure everything out into. I find equal quantities of milk, flour and eggs gives you the desired results. So I'm going to show you what to do. So we've got a little ramekin dish here, which is milk right up to the top. Pour that into your bowl. Now you want exactly the same quantities of eggs. So give your eggs a crack right to the top. Exactly the same as the milk into there and get flour, same quantity of flour, exactly the same way. And as we're whisking, put your flour in. Now the trick is, is to get all that flour mixed into your egg and your milk mix. The consistency we're looking for is a bit like double cream. The main trick to making Yorkshire puddings is a hot oven. Have your pudding tray already in there with a little bit of oil, about a tablespoon, if that, half a tablespoon of oil in each one of your little pudding trays. So once you've got your hot tray with your hot oil already going, pour in gently into each one of those trays. In the meantime, whisk your batter up nice and firm. So when you've got your flour all incorporated in there, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, not too much. And what I like to add is about a tablespoon of water. I find what this does is it gives you a little slightly crisper batter, but gives you a nice soggy center really. About a tablespoon. And you can see the consistency we've got is roughly that of double cream. We're gonna pour into a jug to make it easier to pour into our Yorkshire pudding tray. So we've got our Yorkshire puddings in the oven. We're gonna bake them at 200 for about 30, 35 minutes. After about 20 minutes, just turn your oven down a little bit. Turn it down to about 170, 160. This will just help cook through the center of the Yorkshire puddings. Beautiful, crisp, golden brown, well-risen Yorkshire puddings. Perfect for your Sunday roast.